Hi, this is Hilal. In this video on Mathematical Economics series, we will try to solve a problem that was asked by a friend, Liana, on Econ Maths Telegram channel. The question is like this. Suppose there are 50 identical firms in a perfectly competitive industry and each firm has short-run total cost function is given. We are being given the short-run total cost function of a firm and every firm all firms are identical this is given by 0 0.2 q square plus 5 q plus 10 where q denotes the output calculate uh, the firm's short run supply curve with q that is quantity as a function of market price which is p the options are given as q is equal to p minus 5 upon 0.4 q is equal to 125 p minus 625 q is equal to 1000 under root p minus 2000 so we have to see which of the options is correct okay so the case is about the perfectly competitive uh, industry okay so what is the total cost short run total cost is being given as 0 0.2 q square uh, plus 5 q plus 10 okay this is our short run total cost here we can see many things our total fixed cost is here total uh, fixed cost is here 10 okay so that will the cost which does not depend upon the level of output that is 10 okay and here we can also calculate the average total cost or average variable cost what is our variable cost here variable cost is 0 0.2 q square plus 5 q that vary cost which changes with change in the output okay now what is average variable cost then it is simply 0 0.2 q square plus 5 q and we divided by q okay to get the average and it comes out to be 0 0.2 q uh, plus 5 okay this is our average variable cost function that is 0 0.2 q plus 5 let us uh, see what is our marginal cost also here okay now what is marginal cost marginal cost is simply the derivative of total cost function with respect to output that is q so differentiating this with respect to q so this two will become coefficient so 2 into 0 0.2 comes out to be 0 0.4 q plus the derivative of q is 1 so we are left with 5 and the derivative of a constant is 0 that means our marginal cost is equal to 5 okay now if we can uh, draw the graph here and see how to form the short run supply curve we have quantity obviously on this axis and price on this axis okay what is our uh, average variable cost it is 0 0.2 q plus 5 okay so let's uh, draw average variable cost here let us say this is our average variable cost a v c that is short run average variable cost and sorry our marginal cost uh, is here marginal cost is 0 0.4 q plus 5 okay so our marginal cost is equal to 0 0.4 q plus 5 so the intercept is same here we have for you here we have also for you uh, in case of uh, marginal cost but the slope of the marginal cost is greater than the slope of uh, the average variable cost here slope is 0.4 here is 0.2 so we can form it like this okay this is our short run marginal cost okay now what uh, is the short run uh, supply curve uh, for a firm okay short run supply curve for a firm is that very portion of marginal cost which lies above the average variable cost okay here we can say uh, this very line is above this uh, red line that is average variable cost that means our which is also our price here okay so uh, let me write here this is our price also in case of perfect competition we know price should be equal to marginal cost okay if price is less than 
marginal cost okay output produced will be zero okay as long as price is less than marginal cost or quantity produced will be zero okay when price is greater or equal to marginal cost at that time we can write it like this price is equal to marginal cost okay so when price is equal to marginal cost we have this short run marginal cost function as the firm's supply curve when price is greater or equal to marginal cost at that time uh, the short run uh, supply function of the firm is given by uh, this very line okay that means uh, if i can write it here so supply curve let me write here supply curve in short run is that portion that portion of uh, marginal cost which is above above the short run average variable cost okay this very uh, line is the short run uh, supply curve for a firm okay and at that time we can write also write price is equal to marginal cost if we equate these two what will we get uh, if p is equal to mc so p is equal to what is mc mc is 0.4 q plus 5 now we have to solve q is a function of p so if i transpose this for you here so this will become p minus 5 is equal to 0.4 q which implies q is equal to if we transpose this will get divided so we have p minus 5 upon 0.4 okay this is the short run supply uh, curve for a firm okay i hope i make myself clear in this video i repeat uh, in case of short run uh, marginal uh, cost curve is uh, the short run supply curve when it is above the average variable cost curve and here we can see that uh, this um, black line is above the red line because the slope of this line is uh, 0 0.4 q plus 5 0 0.4 q plus 5 and the slope of this is 0 0.2 q plus 5 or you can simply say if you want to find a short, uh, short on supply curve just equate price is equal to marginal cost you will get the short run supply curve okay so p is equal to what is mc mc we got 0.4 q plus 5 and when solving for q you will get uh, p minus 5 upon 0.4 that means the first option is correct okay I hope I make myself clear in this video. If you like these videos, please share and subscribe to this channel. And also, if you want to donate, you can use the uh, PayPal uh, link given in the info of this channel. Thank you.